Europe has a common set of rules on how to deal with asylum seekers. It applies to most EU member states, some neighbouring countries, but not the UK and Ireland. The so-called Dublin regulation is a key part of that system. It was designed to prevent asylum seekers from submitting applications to multiple EU member states. It stipulates that asylum claims should be processed by the country that played the biggest part in the applicant's entry to the EU, usually the country where they first arrived. But many say the system isn't working. Why? Because of the routes migrants take, asylum seekers first arrive in the EU in a few countries, mainly around the Mediterranean. Countries like Greece and Italy are struggling to process and accommodate all the arrivals. Germany has now become the first country to suspend the Dublin regulation, saying it doesn't work, and the EU has said that the system needs to be restructured. To spread the burden, EU governments have agreed to take in 32,500 asylum seekers over the next two years under a quota system, but they will only take in refugees from Syria and Eritrea. And in July alone, more than 100,000 migrants arrived on Europe's shores. So some countries have taken the matter into their own hands. Hungary and Bulgaria have been building fences along their borders to keep migrants out. Slovakia has been discouraging Muslims from seeking asylum.